In 1498, Vasco de Gama docked on Kapat Beach in southwest India thanks to a wooden craft that enabled him to sail with the team and the merchandises. Also known as Yuru or Dole, this well-made craft were the central way to allow exchanges between Indians, Arabs, Chinese and Europeans in Baipur Commercial Harbour. Nowadays, the commercial harbour has quietened down, however, the traditional Yuru construction is still perpetuating 1,500 years later. Well known for their quality and longevity, their construction requires specialized employees. Woodworkers, carpenters, cabinet makers, sculptors, plumbers, mechanics, electricians, they all using traditional methods and gathering their knowledge to obtain a high quality result. One and a half year construction site, take wood from Malaysia, local cutted fibers to ensure the boat hull in waterproof. No stone is left unturned when it comes to building this giant of the ocean. Yeah, we are using teak wood and the country wood, hardwood and the koila wood. This wood we are using. Uh, teak wood for hull, hull only. And the hardwood we are using for the frame and the um, frame support, everything. And the keel wood we are using koila. 40 people are daily, uh, average daily working for one and a half year. And we are using about uh, 17 th- cubic feet wood and uh, 60 tons of bolt on nails. Here we can uh, make a different shape of uh, vessel. We can make. And uh, one, it will take uh, one and a half year to complete the vessel. And mainly we are exporting to Gulf countries. The total making cost is $300,000 per boat, which is then sold on average $400,000 to the rich Saudi and Arabian families who use it for tourist and individual purposes. But it all starts with the architect Satya Neplatodi, who dreams, thinks and then plans it. Passionated with his vocation, he first builds it as a model. His experience in boat construction enables him to lead the working team every day. The most spectacular part is the launching ceremony when the crowds gather to pray and observe the launching procedures ending in a festive celebration.